accounts. Uh, I, I think it, it's got to be more local stuff. Like I know, even if Ozzy, yeah. like, even if Ozzy four stocks Stango, he would be an honorable mention. He wouldn't be on on the ranking because he doesn't have enough active different yeah. events. I mean, I'm not worried because when I see the PR, I feel like I literally can beat everybody. The only person who I'm like, ah, he's probably gonna get me is like Stango. I feel like everybody else, like I can beat or I have beaten. Yeah. So no, it, to me, like I, it, I don't, I don't really care at all. It doesn't mean anything. You, you I feel like a good record. I feel like it only really matters if like a player's looking in and they just don't see me. But I mean, if you know me, like you know how yeah. I am, whatever. Yeah. Very. I get, I get my respect through my play. I don't care about a list. Yeah, an understanding of the game and more so understanding of what players like to do. Like that's no, that's always how yeah. I respect you as a player. And so many matchups. There's so many people yeah. who are like, I can't counter pick you. I'm like, <laughs> I know. <laughs> So we've we've got the double blue peach team that is Weedle and Control at defeat. Control at defeat a player from Villanova. Oh, the Bay tag is not on. Ne neither of them are are the Bay. Uh, how do you say it? Bears bay of the dot. Bay tag. The Bay dot. Yeah. Uh, be popularized by the blonde bombshell BMC. The dot. Delaware Peach. Yeah. Uh, looking for big things from him at Shine, I believe, as well. Also, a 49th place finisher at SmashCon. That uh, is godlike. Yeah, it did really yeah, well. So good. I, I I've never played him in singles. I'm really jealous. Like I, I just always wanted to play him. It's it's something to marvel at. Much like in Ozzy, where you nowhere. where you play him and you're just like, man, you are really really technical. I gotta focus, but like you're really technical. You get that same feeling with yeah. uh, BMC. Ozzy has limitless potential, I think. So I'm like yeah. super happy like uh, teaming with him because I think like over time like we could do something dangerous. So to finally get into it a little bit, we've got two. We got three peaches on the screen. Two of them teaming, one of them with a Marth. Um, it's it's an interesting choice to see the double peach because they can definitely. Marth is a lucky guy. <laughs> it's, his, it's his personal harem. Uh, so oh my god! Yeah, Umbrellas beat swords. <laughs> So with it, it's kind of interesting. They're two fairly slow characters, so they actually can't help each other out too much unless they really play close to each other. This is the double peach team, of course. Yeah. And yeah, they they build up damage fast, but they may have trouble killing. They've really got to communicate as to who's going to cover what recovery options from which character. Yeah, I feel like double peach is actually not too good of a team because they're just so e easily to get like spaced out, and in teams like you really have to be there for your teammate when it counts. And so. I think really this set change. will really come down to Nagy's play. Nagy being the solo Marth on the screen, having the time of his life, Definitely. swinging the sword, just going at going to town. Zant kind of just mindlessly dash dancing around the bottom. Wow, back All right, now, Ooh. oh, okay. Now Marth Peach, is that a matchup that oh. you've tried? Because yeah. I, I know I uh, I don't have much experience in it, but okay. I feel like Marth does like slightly win, especially because Peaches hate it. <laughs> and once you get in their head, oh, that's like yes. half the battle. So like, it's like 55-45, oh. but if you get in their head, it's definitely like 60-40. And I feel like yeah. Marth usually like starts with the lead just because of like spacing. And Peach has to pull a turn up, so you can just like dash dance around and they're like, I gotta pull a turn up. And then you run in and dash attack him or yeah. get him. And there's just mm -hmm. so many like little mix-ups like that. Yeah, and, and Marth able to really add on damage quickly. Not a lot of characters can do that. It's really yeah. Fox But and, Peach uh, can edge guard the hell out of them too. Yeah. And that's where it comes down to the other Peach to help uh, Nagy recovering, but it's also kind of tough when you have a slower character. Now, what we didn't mention before is Weedle and Control of Defeat. Not lesser known about Control of Defeat, but more known about Weedle. Someone who really theorizes, uh, kind of crafts, and, and thinks about their team combos a lot. What moves good? leads into what? Yes, because they're both players that do that. So, we actually saw something on FD that started to look like a little bit of a uh, little bit of European goodness, passing. I believe it was the Marth, just back and forth with a couple nares. It tried. They tried to end it with an up air. So they're both very experimental in terms of their team combos, and it could. Yeah, mean I also feel like it's really crazy. hard for Peach to team combo too, because by the time like one nares the other way, it's really hard for the other one to like jump up and like like follow up on it. Yeah, fairly slow characters. I believe game two just started with about five down smashes from the screen. <laughs> Granted, with three peaches, I believe that's, that's like how you one know piece. That's how that. you know who's winning. Up oh, and uh, blue teams definitely win the down smash battle. <laughs> and uh, we don't rock in the Captain Norway tag today. With I his, love uh, it. Yeah, his uh, his cape is sick. Yes, with the Norwegian flag bearing it on his back, the hopes and dreams of all of his people. And uh, Nagy, to a lesser degree, rocking the Yuan tag, a very, very, very formidable Fox Falco dual uh, main. Definitely a hidden boss that I can't even actually even talk about. I just know he's hella good. Yeah, from uh, University of Delaware. We were just talking about him before we walked in here. We were talking about if, if uh, Rosalind could beat Delaware in a crew battle. 
Who? Roslyn. Like, th this area. Like, oh, okay. me, Stango. Oh, yeah, me, Stango, Hot Mash, Preston, and... I have my doubts. Oh, maybe we could do it. And Captain Yolo, though. Captain uh, Yolo's a wild card. He could do it. Against you, but you, Delaware, right? Yeah, I'd, I'd like to see it. I think, it I, think, I think it could happen. It'd be, it'd be an interesting one to see. Uh, Sounds doubtful. <laughs> I think I think it would uh, come down to Stango BMC. And yeah. it, Stango would most likely take it, but with how many stocks remaining. Yeah. Oh, oh there's the down smashes. All right. All right, so it's six stocks apiece, but red team falling behind definitely in the percent yeah, battle. Yeah, basically two stocks behind at this point. But Marth, one, one, once again, like one of the few characters against Peach that has some gimp potential. You know, jump reads, Front kind throw of. throw down air. Yeah, exactly, and just like these these different mix-ups and good ways to deal with Peach's recovery tools, the yeah. double jump, the and, float, and tempers are just monstrous. Oh, and unfortunately, they both just died right next to each other. Missed, yeah, missed each other's up bees. Zant went for a team save, and uh, it did not work out for him. The Seems blue team, <laughs> wow. DIing into each other, one of them falls off of the bottom, and it was I believe it was a one lower percent. Not sure if that was really worth it. Oh, there's a front throws. All right, Nagy. Oh, okay, connects an air on the other Peach, only down a stock. But that was down smashes from blue team. I mean, that's that's killer, man. They they can add on the percentage so fast. Um, I love the Norway tag. It looks so good for some reason. It's like no no capitalization. It, it's like trying not to be too obtrusive. It's just like oh I'm, I'm here. But, yeah. Know, don't don't mind me. Don't let me get in your way. <laughs> oh, now up smash would have actually definitely killed if they sweet spotted at 86. percent I think it's gonna be really hard for red team to bring this back. I have my doubts. Team kill Nair into blue team back air. Ooh. Gets completely dragged up by the down air. That's that's this, almost this, certain death. This is looking like the set. This is not not really doable for Peach. Yeah. And Zant. And that should uh, be it. Nice. That's an edge guard. A Peach main should know how Peach's recovery works. 2-0 for the double Peach team. It looks like they're not moving. Captain Yolo. I believe I just heard is getting called to the stream station. So you might see some of that sick. So I'm playing teams, you know, we're in the bracket and